today I'm just going to read you a love story. It's from Isaiah 63. I will mention the loving kindness of the Lord and the praises of the Lord according to all that the Lord hath bestowed upon us and the great goodness towards the house of Israel which he has bestowed on them according to his mercies, according to the multitude of his loving kindnesses. For he said, Surely they are my people, children that will not lie. So he was their Savior. In all their affliction he was afflicted, and the angel of his presence saved them. In his love and in his pity he redeemed them, and he bared them and carried them all the days of old. And skipping over to 64. For since the beginning of the world, men have not heard nor perceived by the ear, neither has the eye seen, O God, beside thee, what he has prepared for him that waits for him. But we are all as unclean thing, and all our righteousnesses are as filthy rags. And we all do fade as a leaf, and our iniquities, like the wind, has taken us away. And there's none that calls upon thy name and stirs up himself to take hold of thee. For thou hast hid thy face from us and consumed us because of our iniquities. But now, O Lord, thou art our Father. We are the clay, thou art potter, and we are all the work of thy hand. That's from the Old Testament. And in the New, he tells us we are his precious sons and daughters. He paid the high price. We are his forever, grafted in, chosen, and loved with an everlasting love. Amen. It's ours for the believing. Amen.